In this video, I'm going to show you how easy it is to add and set up FAQ schema with Rank Math plugin. Why you should add FAQs? FAQs are a great way to answer common questions about your blog and also they can help you increase your conversion. Now that I have your attention, if you haven't subscribed to this channel, click the subscribe button and hit the bell notification to be notified for all the updates. Now, let's do this video. Let's go. Hi, my name is Yogesh. Welcome to my channel, Utilize Your Business. I also have a blog with the same name, Utilize Your Business. Everything that I talked about, all the strategy tactics regarding the SEO, I do use it on my blog and you can see it yourself by visiting utilizeyourbusiness.com. I know a lot of people don't understand what FAQ schema is or why they should use FAQ on their blog posts. In this video, I'm going to show you exactly how easy it is to add the FAQ schema to your blog post and why you should be using it to boost traffic to your website. Now, be sure to subscribe to my channel if you want to learn about affiliate marketing, SEO, and about uh, YouTube videos in general to help you make you better affiliate marketer so that you can make money online. Before going ahead, let me ask you a question. Have you ever bothered using a FAQ on your blog post? Put in the comment yes or no. Before I show you how to add FAQ with uh, Rank Rank plugin, why don't I do an FAQ on a schema? So what is schema? Schema markup allows webmasters such as Google and all that to provide rich snippets of their content. It tells Google exactly what type of content it is and what information is inside the content. It can rank your website hires by providing some of the common questions they're looking for or some of, some of the information on the website, such as the contact information hours or providing common answers to the questions if they're reading your blog post or article. Now, why use schema? Why should you be using schema on your website? Schema, when used correctly, can actually boost traffic to your website because you're providing most common answers to the questions what visitors are looking for. So it's really important if you want to boost your traffic to your website and it might also increase the conversion rate click to ratio so very important now that being said let's dive in and show you how easy it is to add the uh, faq schema with the rank man plugin now let me show you how all right so um, how to turn the uh, faq block to accordion uh, the first thing is you need a uh, plugin which is this turn rank mat FAQ plugin to accordion. So what I do is just copy that and then you go to the plugin section of your website. Uh, add new. And what you do is just copy that, enter. And this is what you have it, right? and then you hit the active all right let's go back to the post and it was this one so it already has these ones let's see if if that plugin have done the trick all right, so let's go down right here it is right see there you have that this and this which is right here it makes your F and Q um, you know much better and it's you know it looks nice and uh, that's what it is guys so that uh, uh, looks nicer people are more tend to uh, click on this uh, too. so let me know in the comments if you like my bonus tip of how to turn the Mac FAQ blog to the uh, accordion all right guys to you know 
posting facebook marketplace right and you can you can add whatever else you want to add it on right so that's the thing and then so you keep adding the question and you know um you can go back to google and you know look at it what people are looking for it will give you an idea and uh, you can just put that on on it too so you can put how to get real estate leads right advertising email marketing and i'm just putting it in i'm just want to show you what else you can do with this you know are free leads better than eight right and you can answer yes okay so okay so these are the thing you'll get a little tidbits on the, where you can do the styling for your faq right so the first one is list style you can number it or unorder it so i like to put a number in the title you want to put to uh, you know what you want to do the uh, 3 h3 h4 h5 or you want just want to do paragraph i use these leave it at uh, h3 the image so you can also add image if you want it you can do the uh, thumbnail or the large or full size thumbnail is good uh, all you got to do is add image and let's do this uh, let's make it smaller select see right here you have the image and uh, let me move this up again <laughs> um, so these are all the styling options you can do the SS code I'm not going to go into that right so once you've done all that uh, let's go to preview and see how it is right so right here you have it one two three these are all faqs you have it right here and you can also uh, double check on the thing if it's right here right and this is how you basically set up the faq schema on your blog post and i'm going to show you my website that's i'll put this down um, blog and this is the latest blog that i did if i click on this and you'll see it right here are the FAQs that I, I just did two of them but these are the FAQ that I did and this is how it will show up on your blog post all right so it's very simple uh, if you're using rank mat you don't have to worry about coding or or all the other the stuff that um, most of us are not familiar with all right. so as you can see it's really easy, really simple to add FAQ schema to your blog post using a Rank Math plugin. And I recommend for you to start using that on most of your blog posts so that you get your traffic will grow when you're using this FAQ schema. And also at the same time, you know, you might have a conversion rate going up too because people are looking for some of the common questions and what if your website can give answers to them right so it's a win-win situation that's what all you wanted as a you know blog post or as a website where people come in and being converted to products or services let me know in the comment did you get value from what i just showed you how to add faq schema to your blog post now, since you're watching this, I'm going to share a bonus tip for you, how to turn FAQ block that we just built into accordion. For that, I'm just going to 
go back and actually show you a step by step don't worry it's uh, not that long it's easy within the minute you can add this uh, plugin to your website and make it the FAQ more uh, nicer let me show you how all right so um, how to turn the uh, FAQ blog to accordion uh, the first thing is you need a uh, plugin which is this turn rack mat FAQ plugin to accordion so what I do is just copy that and then you go to the plugin section of your website uh, add new and we do is just copy that enter and this is what you have it right this is and then you hit it active. Alright, let's go back to the post. And it was this one. So, it already has these ones. Let's see if, if that plugin have done the trick. All right, so let's go down right here. It is right. See, there you have that. This and this, which is right here, it makes your F and Q, um, you know, much better. And it's you know, it looks nice. Uh, that's what it is guys so that uh, uh, looks nicer people are more tend to uh, click on this uh, too. so let me know in the comments if you like my bonus tip of how to turn the Mac FAQ block to the uh, accordion all right guys well that's the end of this video let me know your thoughts about this video and thank you for subscribing if you haven't subscribed to my channel hit that subscribe button and the bell notification for any of the new updates from this channel after subscription just watch our other videos that's out on the thing uh, in terms of uh, you know what are the best plugins to use about the seo affiliate marketing and about the youtube how to optimize uh, youtube videos stay tuned for the next video bye